While the Ukraine-Russia war has been going on for more than a year, Ukraine's recent increase in drone strikes has caused great panic on Russian soil. These attacks were recorded as the largest drone attacks since the beginning of the war. Although the Russian Defense Ministry announced that Ukraine's coordinated drone attacks were prevented, images shared on social media showed that the attacks caused explosions and fires in some regions. One of the regions in Russia where the most intense attacks took place was Pisco, close to the Estonian border. It was stated that at least 10 drones caused explosions and fires at the airport, and flights in the city were also stopped. These attacks were announced by the governor of Pisco, Mikhail Vedernikov, who said that efforts were underway to determine the extent of the damage. Russian officials stated that Ukrainian drones targeted infrastructure in other regions as well, especially in Moscow, Bryansk, Oral, Kaluga, and Ryazan regions. The airspace was closed as a precautionary measure. Moscow Mayor Sergei Sobyanin stated that the drone shutdown near the capital caused no damage. In addition, according to the Russian Defense Minister's statement, naval aviation aircraft of the Black Sea Fleet allegedly destroyed landing routes of Ukrainian Special Operation Forces, soldiers in the Black Sea. Russia had temporarily closed its airspace in some predetermined regions due to increased attacks and increased security measures by deploying air defense systems in critical centers. These developments are of great importance for the escalating tension in the Ukraine-Russia war and the course of the conflict. What do you think about these developments? How might the escalating tensions between Ukraine and Russia and increased drone strikes affect the course of the conflict? We look forward to your views.